Alright, I can probably bait him to me, but... Well, why not? Let's, let's bait him. Alright. Can I get a sap guard? Oh, not in range? Okay, fine, screw that. Oh, he might actually attack us from a row, but that's not much of a problem now. We have him cornered. He can only kill off one character at a time, like, at least a lot. In the last chapter, so... Oh, just gonna use a mini spell? I offer you a choice. Surrender or die. No way that's gonna happen. What are you gonna do? Oh, poison blow! Behold. I'm so scared. Alright, let's get a sap guard onto him. Yeah, in cases like these, sap guard comes really useful. Because you're fighting an enemy that has a lot of HP and a lot of, uh... You're basically assassinating one enemy that has a lot of HP and a lot of defense. Sap guard. Trust me, it really, really helps. That little tidbit really, really helps. Okay. Get behind the guy. And we're gonna grant cross him. Like we, like we always do with, uh... Our assassination missions. All I am able to do, I shall. Alright, this should be good. Razor's Edge, here we go. He has holy protection, so we'll Alright, I'll just start with Locksmith anyway. Anyway, he's not gonna do much Where damage after all. Here and now. It was my guys who did most of the damage. Phantom destruction! Now a lot of damage. I never miss. Well, keep going at it. Your keep them coming. The edge of my blade. Strike. Giant player. Oh, almost there. All right. Now you can finish it off. Oh, that was so necessary. Now you join the ranks of the fallen. <laughs> Funny. The fallen. After what he's caused. Grim vengeance. How does it feel? That's right. You better die. For you. Why does he still hold rolls when he uh -huh. dies? That's what I like to know. I mean, when you when you die, doesn't your grip weaken? I don't know. All right. Well. Let's see what we get here. We get training, aura flux, regeneration, magic mail, but the reason why I wanted the 100% or 200 or more sin was just for the ether gloves. You only you only get those from uh, getting the lowest amount of sin or meeting the sin required for the battle, so well, there you have it. I just want the ether gloves. Ready to die? Prepare to die. Smoke you! What? Sympathy? You're not gonna burn me to a crisp like what happened at the end of the last chapter now, are you? I hope you don't. Just because they... really? Thank you for mentioning the two. Thank you very much. Aha! So it was true after all. I knew it. It says so in the lore.
I think you've sacrificed more people than I have ever done in this entire path ALP. I mean, jeez. I can't believe you just stabbed him in the back like that. Why do they do that anyway? That's what I like to know. They pit, they pit siblings against each other. It's like... What's the point of growing the bond if that's gonna happen? Why did you have to kill him? Wow, I can't believe that, Wilfred. After all that he's done, you're gonna let him go like that? Alright! Wow! That's his punishment, really? Coming from Wilfred, that's really, really something. Wow. And Foxnell has now permanently joined the party. Isn't that lovely? Right after we killed him in battle. Yeah, he totally got Grand Cross there. It was crazy. Might work, you never know. For once, we're finally gonna do something after talking about it for some time now. Oh man. Hopefully, not. Was the tune like anyway? Would that help? Well, the scene is pretty much the same no matter what path you play, so yeah. Promises! <laughs> It's highlighted. And we never see him ever again. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, here we go again. we've been through this before? Except this time, really important duties call. Alright, alright. Well, that certainly transpired really, really quickly. But what sort of duty calls Wilfred, and who will we side with? Find out next time on the final chapter of Let's Play Valkyrie Profile, Covenant of the Plume.
This is Flash Sub-Zero, flashing off. Goodbye, world!